According to WHO, 214 million women of reproductive age in developing countries who want to avoid pregnancy are not using any contraceptive method. There are also millions of women who use contraception in an incorrect way. To reduce an intended pregnancy, abortion, sudden diseases, and maternal and child mortality rate of a country, women should use the most suitable types of contraceptive methods by counseling with doctors. Firstly, I'd like to show some benefits of family planning, birth spacing, or contraception. These include reduce infant death due to an unwanted pregnancy, reduce maternal death due to unsafe abortion, prevent certain health problems in women with recent abortion or gave birth to a child by cesarean section, etc., prevent sexually transmitted diseases by using a certain type of contraception, reduce adolescent pregnancies, before we get into the topic, be sure to hit the subscribe button if you are new here because we are uploading health and fitness tips weekly and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss these helpful tips. There are different methods of contraception. Here is the list of some effective methods of contraception. Number 1. The intrauterine device also known as IUCD. Number 2. Implants such as Jadel Implantum. Number 3. Injections such as Depo-Provarid or DMPA, depo Medrosiprogesterone Acetate, Cyanopress Injection. Number 4. Pills such as Combined Oral Contraceptive Pills, COCs, Progesterone-Only Pills, the Emergency Contraceptive Pill. Number 5. Barrier Methods such as Condoms, Diaphragm. Number 6. Fertility Awareness by Calendar Method or Making Notice About Signs of Fertility in the Menstrual Cycle. Number 7. Withdrawal Method. Number 8. Permanent Contraception, Sterilization by Tubal Ligation and or Vasectomy. Among these, intrauterine device IUD and implants are long-acting reversible contraceptive methods which means they can help you prevent pregnancy for some years and if you want to get pregnant again, you can get contraception quickly after removing the device from your body. IUD lasts for about 5-10 to 10 years according to its types. Implants such as the Dell Implantant last for about 3-5 to 5 years. Their effectiveness in preventing pregnancy is about more than 99%, so they are most suitable and effective types of contraception. Combined or contraceptive pills, COCs, progesterone-only pills, and injectable Depo-Provera are common types of contraceptive that use hormones to prevent pregnancy. COCs are pills that you need to take one pill per day regularly. Their effectiveness is more than 99% with correct and consistent use and about 92% as commonly used. Progesterone-only pills can be used while breastfeeding and must be taken at the same time each day. Its effectiveness is about 90-97% to as commonly used. Depo injection is another type of hormonal contraception. You must get an injection every 3 months and if you get the timely injection, it is more than 99% effective. Barrier methods can stop sperm from entering into the vagina. Male and female condoms are the most commonly used barrier methods. Condoms can prevent unintended pregnancy and sexually transmitted diseases such as HIV, AIDS, herpes, syphilis, and gonorrhea. Their effectiveness is 90-98% to with correct and consistent use and 79-85% to as commonly used. And they are easily available from supermarkets and many drugstores. Emergency contraceptive pills are used for emergency contraception if you had unprotected sex, condom splits or failure, mixed COC pills, mix an injection and suffer from sexual crimes. The best time interval to take the pills for its highest effectiveness is within 72 hours. If all 100 women used progestin-only emergency contraceptive pills, only one would likely to become pregnant. But be aware that it's not suitable for long-term use. Calendar method and withdrawal method are said to be traditional methods. The Galena method is used by monitoring the pattern of the menstrual cycle and the couple prevents pregnancy by avoiding unprotected sex during first and the last estimated fertile days. You can be counseled about the detail of this method with your doctor. 
It is effective at about 91% with correct and consistent use and with 75% with common use. Withdrawal method Men withdraw his penis from the vagina and ejaculate outside the vagina to prevent sperm from entering the female's body. This is the least effective method because proper timing of withdrawal is often difficult to determine. So this method is not recommended for birth spacing and family planning. And there is a permanent contraceptive method called sterilization which prevents all future pregnancies and is irreversible. Sterilization contains mainly two methods, vasectomy and tubal ligation. Vasectomy is done in male. It is permanent contraception to block the juice that carries sperm from testes by keeping sperm out of ejaculated semen. Its effectiveness is more than 99% after 3 months of doing a vasectomy. Tubal ligation is done in the female. It is permanent contraception by blocking the eggs from meeting sperm. Its effectiveness is also more than 99%. Both methods need a voluntary and informed choice. Sterilization is mainly done with the patient's choice and doctor's recommendation for some obstetric and gynecological problems. So, these are the most commonly used methods of contraception. But you should also keep in mind that there is no method of contraception that can keep you 100% away from pregnancy. You should choose contraception based on your preference, and you should discuss properly with your partner before choosing a certain method of contraception. I will describe the details of some contraceptive next week. It will contain how to use advantages and disadvantages of using it so stay tuned. Family planning and birth spacing become more important issue nowadays. Consultation with obstetrician and gynecologist about family planning is highly recommended. I hope this post can share some ideas about contraceptive methods and make you choose wisely that would be most suitable for you. Thank you for watching the video until the end. If you want me to cover any other health related topics, feel free to ask me in the comments below or directly through my email. Peace out.